Hi, we start with a new recipe. We will cook a, a nice fillet of tuna in crust of coffee with a cream of red pepper. What we're gonna use is a nice piece of tuna. Be careful because the tuna must be of first quality for anything you do. This kind of tuna is coming from Sri Lanka and is being catched from the Tuna King supplied by King Catch. And now we will use this fillet and uh, you see, it's a beautiful part of it. I really don't like to do it, but I have. So I will cut this fillet of tuna like that. Here we go. And we've got this fillet. What I have to do now is just put a marinated with extra virgin olive oil. A little bit of salt. So all the ingredients we will use for this recipe are extra virgin olive oil, powder of coffee, salt, balsamic vinegar, this uh, green stuff that is a, a pepper grass, tuna, and the last ingredient is a, a red pepper. So what we have to do now is just start to roast this uh, red pepper. So I just put in the pan like that and we have to wait that the skin is getting burned and after we will peel it. Let's start with the tuna. So we put extra virgin olive oil and the salt. We put some stuff of this and some extra virgin olive oil again. And now we go all around like that. We have to massage the meat. The red pepper now that's gonna take 15 minutes or something like that, but we have already done. That's the end, what we need to do. Sometimes there are some parts that we, we can take the skin off and we can burn with it. There is a beautiful smell of red pepper now. So what we need now is just to put the tuna, the fillet inside the frying pan, like that. We will cook all around, all the sides. That's one, the first side. Now we will see one thing. From the bottom here, now the color will change. So the color is becoming up, yeah? That means that the tuna is cooked. But we will leave a red part in the middle because the tuna is so fantastic and great. It's a yellow fin, so why cook it? It's better to eat raw like that. So we have just to touch for three times, no more than that. Okay, now I'm gonna clean the red pepper, so I take the skin off. You see, it's very easy to make it. All right, this is one. We take all the seeds off and all the skin, that's it. So we've got this side, yeah, is already cooked. We have to sear the tuna on the other side, like that. It's just rolling all around yeah, and cooking. You see this part, yeah, it's cooked and the middle is red. That's, that's great, it's fantastic. Now we have to put the red pepper inside this container, like that, salt, extra virgin olive oil. So now we have this sauce, yeah, that is a fresh sauce. It's just made with red pepper, olive oil, extra virgin, and a little bit of salt. It's really Mediterranean and tasty, and you know, it's full of, it's fresh. We carry on with the tuna. We can put a little bit of salt on top. Here we go. So we've got the last side, yeah. We cook like that. We have to put some coffee all around here, so we need extra virgin olive oil. We have to put the tuna fillet, like that, and after we pass the coffee, yeah? This coffee is very good. It's 100% pure Arabic and it's coming from Brazil. You see, all around, on this way. Now we just take the fillet of tuna. We just add a little bit of extra virgin olive oil. We have just to toast a little bit the coffee so we've got the flavor of it. We take this plate, like that, and we're gonna put the red pepper sauce just in the middle like that. 
nice color, really red. Now we can do two different things. This kind of cooking is, is really rare, it's not even medium. Can be blue, like usually we see in the kitchen. And we can leave the fillet of tuna like that, in the middle of the plate. Or otherwise we can try to slice it in more parts, like one part, this one, and we put in the middle of the plate. And there we go, the plate is done. We need just a little bit of balsamic vinegar. That is going like that. And some salt. Nothing salt, but a little bit bigger. Like that. Great. And extra virgin olive oil. Here we go. It's done. Enjoy your meal. This one is my suggestion for this beautiful plate. It's a fillet of tuna in crust of coffee. This kind of wine is uh, coming from Lazio, yeah, it's my region, uh, close to the sea from Aprilia, and is made of two different kinds of grapes. One is Chardonnay and the other one is Viognier. Perfume of this wine are something like a flower, so you can, you can smell chamomile or brooms. It's a smart wine. And at the end uh, is, is very persistent, uh, you can test the vanilla and I think it's a good choice for your tuna.